All right, here we are inside the tree base. We've only got a couple more days left with this base, uh, and then we're gonna restart and play some RL craft. So we have decided to put together some fun events for the last day of the server. I built a parkour course. What time is it? It's turning night. We'll get through the night. I'll be right back. And now it's daytime, so let's go. I thought building a parkour course right here next to my, my fallen tree base might kind of ruin the aesthetic, so I built it off this way a bit. Um, yeah, go. There he goes. Okay. Built this little landing pad here. And I failed to use it correctly. So let's go inside. I kinda I wanted people to land here and to see the castle and not just kinda swoop down into it. So I built that here at the entrance. So I built it in tiers and I kinda built a walkway to guide people through it. The only tier that doesn't have a walkway is diamond tier. But that's the last one. I don't know if they're necessarily easier or harder as they go. This first one's obviously real easy. And I did that. This is a really bad representation of what I wanted to show. See, this one was pretty easy. But then I just tried to make them get harder as they go. I'm not very good at this stuff, as you can see. So, <clears throat> when the whole community on here gets together, uh, I'm going to give everybody three lives per tier. And then I'm going to give them points based on how far they make it. And then who the winner is, but there's a bonus round at the end that I'll show you here in a second. Okay, so one pro tip, don't do parkour with your elytra on. Anytime I try to do this one, I like slide weirdly off these fences. Alright. Yeah. This one's probably my least, well no it's not. That one's my least favorite. <clears throat> I do once again want to point out that I'm not good at this Minecraft parkour. There we go. The water doesn't seem to affect people as much as I thought it might, but I was hoping it would at least... Wow, really? That it would at least mess with their, their mind a little bit as they tried to jump from one to the other. I'm gonna try this again. See how much of this even makes it to the final cut. Wow, that probably won't. Wow. Alright. Almost back to where things started going bad for me. Uh, do I have to run there? I guess I have to run there. This is embarrassing. I built this. I promise I've made it through this before. Wow. Alright. That's it. This is the one. Uh... Machu built a race course. Joker was talking about building a uh, Elytra arena. Um, I don't know if he's gotten around to that. Um, Mikrathine built a... Dang it. Well, I'm not doing that again. Mikrathine built a PvP arena. And... 
uh, Mel, his name on here is Ritraz, Mel built a, or he was going to build Spleef Arenas. Dang it. Eat this before I die. Yeah, don't close that. That's no bueno. Alright. I think what happens is I hit my head on that. I think that's what knocks me down. Once I get up here, it's alright. Alright. This is the worst part of this one. Well, no, it's not. Getting up that thing is the worst part of this one. Alright. Then we gotta crouch to get through here. I'm gonna cheat. I don't feel like going all the way back through this. And I'm gonna cheat again. I'm gonna cheat a third time. Wow. Am I serious right now? Wow. This is... okay. This is just sad at this point. <sighs> oh my goodness. There we go. Made it through that one. Now this one is not fun for me either. So once again, I'm not good at this Minecraft parkour. And if what you think you're hearing is doors opening and closing, you're absolutely correct. Alright, you're not allowed to open the last three. You can only open the spruce ones on this one. Alright, walk of shame back down the middle of this. Yeah, let me through. There we go. Wow. Alright, I'll give this one one more shot. But I'm really just doing this as a preview. Wow, that one doesn't count. Mulligan. Alright. Make a fool of me in my own course. Wow. Yeah, so this is just a preview. It's hard for me to talk and do this at the same time. But this wasn't meant to be a preview. I don't know if the others will preview their their contributions. Wow, that like slapped me down. But I think you get the idea. If I had done it correctly, I would have landed on this last one, and then just had to jump to the line. If you land before the line on any of these, then you... that's a fail. <clears throat> so like here, or there, or the one for iron tier, you have to make it all the way out to the line at least. We come up here for emerald tier. I actually never jumped across this one. because I'm bad at this.
I mean, if you just stood here and walked long enough, you'd figure out what doors don't actually close. Or open, excuse me. Or whatever the bad position is. Uh, I'm gonna jump forward a day again, and then I'll go up and start Diamond Tier, which, as you can see, wraps all the way around this guy. Nice enough, isn't it? Alright, it's daytime again. I don't have to worry about creepers blowing up my course. Uh, I don't know if anybody else on the server is making something. I think the only other people were Quinoa and Jet, and I don't know if they were going to build something or not, but if they do, we'll get to see that too. Uh, I'm making this on Thursday. We're going to do all the events on Saturday, and then I will have to you know, edit and get these videos uploaded. So the parkour run, I don't know exactly when that'll be up, but you can look for it maybe as early as Saturday night or uh, hopefully by Wednesday. It'll depend just on how many events we have and how long it all takes. Well, who would have guessed? <clears throat> There's no real prizes for winning or anything, it's just a fun way to say goodbye to our server. Whoa, that one pixel save. Learn that in Mario. Alright, don't touch that pressure plate or you lose. Oh, don't back off or you lose. That pressure plate's my one sneaky trap in this whole thing. And if you hit it, it just fires a piston that pushes those blocks out from underneath you. And then you fall. As you might have imagined, by having the blocks pushed out underneath you. Wow. You know, maybe if nothing else, this will serve to show people you don't have to be as good as the ones you see online or on other videos. Just play with it and have fun. You know. You know, miss every one of them, as long as you're having fun. <clears throat> I barely saved that. And I didn't save it there. Okay, so... Uh, I'm gonna play like, like if we were doing golf, I already called a mulligan. Now I'm calling best ball and I'm running back up to where I had already made it before. All right. This one I've thought about doing as a time trial instead of as a a point system, to where uh, you get the points, most points for being in first place of the time trial, and that's why I built this. Because if you fall off like that, you can't just jump up around this fence. There's no getting back up. You have to come back over here and start again. So it's kind of like a checkpoint, almost, I guess. Or at least this one room has its own checkpoint. I might build something here for people to get up so that, you know, if you make it to here, it's like another checkpoint. And then you just have to get through this part of it. over that one. Oh. Yeah, so uh, I'm gonna cheat my way back over to probably there. Don't judge me. I have jumped through these things so many times building them that it's just not even fun for me anymore. Nah, that's not true. It's still entertaining. It's just this course itself and all the time that I had to spend coming up with different stuff that that people could still do, that I could bring the oh, five or seven people that we're gonna have for this over to it and get it done in a reasonable amount of time to where we weren't like up all night, everyone getting tired of being here. Because, you know, charcoal was all of that and then, you know, each tier going across the map or something. I was trying to be reasonable with how I, how I built this. Excuse me. So, you know, coming up with all these different tiers. Dang it. Alright, and... 
jump. And we're back. Alright. I've made it through this, I promise. I've made it through every one of these. I just can't do it today. But I did... I... Dang it! I wouldn't say that I have an unfair advantage from practicing. I mean, maybe over somebody that is as bad as I am, but... Oh my. Oh my. Walk of shame. Eat my potatoes. We're gonna get this. We're gonna get this this time. It, yeah. There's no more. I see this on Reddit all the time, people doing this kind of stuff. Ha! Huh. I don't know why I do these things. It's like I hate fun. And then do the ladders. That's it. That. I just, I just wanted to show the thing that I made, and instead I'm just embarrassing myself. I'm, I'm. Oh, I thought I was missing this one. All right, come on. Thank you. All right. I hate these. I hate this so much. I built it. I hate it. No, please. Nope. Let go of the W. Okay. Oh, why? Why didn't I build stairs on this side? You know what? You get the idea. You get you get what's going on here. Um, so I beat it. Yay! Awesome. You get it. Um, and then after all of this, after so many points, so it might be something like, like make it here for one point, finish it out for another point. You know, one point, one point, one point, and two points. You know, it might be something like that, or it might be like. You know, two points, two points, two points, and then one, you know, one on those, maybe, maybe like four points all together, just getting across this. You know, I think it'll be something like that. I gotta figure out a point system. <clears throat> but then, and I, I still need to get the netherite for this, so uh, come back and see if I ever got all the netherite. You saw how I did the starting positions over there, so if I'm gonna do the same thing here, I would need three netherite blocks here, three there, uh, two here, or they might go up top because this is already kind of cramped, and then two there, and then three across here, and maybe, it looks like I already got bedrock there, but I can still do a couple down there. Um, yeah, so come back and see if I ever got those. I'm definitely not even going to try these. Um, this is the wall hopping with either sand or gravel. I have tried that so many times, and I've only ever gotten one good jump where I hit and jumped off of it. Or, I've done that a couple times, but I've only ever gotten that first one. That's what I mean. And I, I just, I always end up placing it in front of myself and then hitting it. This is the boat hop. We have the sand, the boats, and this is the water bucket. And you... You know, you jump down there, you save yourself with a water bucket, and you pick the water right back up. Uh, these ones are going to be optional, they're bonus rounds, so if we get to the end of it and say somebody's winning and somebody's not far behind, that person who's not far behind is welcome to come in here and 
gamble their points. So you put 10 points up for this one. If you make it, you get 20 points back. If you don't make it, you lose that 10 points. Uh, same here. And then this one, I was thinking about it being 5 points if you survive. 10 points if you can hit, put the water down, survive, and pick it back up before it spreads. You know, that double click that you see online. So, if you guys like my parkour course or you want to see um, the other courses, you know, come back and watch people have fun with it. Like it if you thought it was a good one. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Oh, it's night again. Bad guys. I don't want creepers up in here. Give me that. So, you know, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, more than I did trying to run around it because I apparently am terrible. So, you guys... Have a good day.